I want a God of High School season two. I just want it. When are we going to get it? Oh. Jin Mori, requested by Gizlane on Patreon. I have drawn it before, um, but sh Gizlane sent me a sketch. Oh, where's it gone? One second. <laughs> we are having difficulties. Where did that go? Okay, I found it. So, landscape page, pencil eraser, hit pause, we'll go too fast. Let's draw this smiley Jin Mori. Center point here. The eyes are about halfway, right? Got big hair and stuff. It's kind of like a, he's a mixture between Goku and Naruto kind of. So go. Curving line, big curving line for his eye. Like, what way did they do it? Yeah, it's kind of like a normal sort of, it's just like a curved line. Like that, it's kind of like thicker in the middle. Well, in the anime, anyway. So it's kind of up to you if you want to go anime or manga. Although it's not a manga, is it? No. So I'm going kind of a mixture between the two. Okay, curve line like that. His bottom eyelid line is just like a little thing like this. You could go more, maybe. Right, and then his cool eyes. Down like so. Now, he's got that star in the middle, and it's kind of tricky to draw. So, let's see what we can do. So, we'll go like with the spike there first. And then it goes right out to there and then there. And then the arm seems to come back in. And it's all dark around it. So, um, I think this should be a bit thinner. Right, so then sort of a frowning, smiling, eyebrow standard kind of a thing, just going this way. And I think it's brown, so we'll add just a space that we can color in. And then maybe like an eyelid line, just there. So most of this is under like his hair and his fringe and stuff. So don't worry too much about it. We we'll go over and do the other eye. Curving up and over again. And we'll just thicken it up a bit and add some hairy eyelid spikes. And then bottom eyelid line. Like that again, and then that sort of long. Eye. And then we do this spike here again. Come down from the top and then the arms kind of come out. Stars can be tricky, so don't beat yourself up. Okay. Right, and then eyebrow. Going that way. And just like a section that you can color a bit. And then there is no eyelid line in the drawing, but I do like to add them. So his nose, 
pretty simple. So we just have two nostril lines down here. And like maybe like a tip of his nose sort of thing. And then he's got like a big smile. So we go. Like so first. And then like the edge of his mouth here. And then we can see some like sharp sort of teeth lines just going across that way. So you don't have to draw like all the teeth, just like the bare minimum. And then his chin, relatively pointy chin. Which will go up his jaw. And go underneath like his fringe. Kind of more on this side for some reason. This side turns and goes up. So then his fringe and hair spikes. So say the big long one here. coming up that way and then there's all smaller ones coming across the front here and then he's got like a big one here in the middle Lots of different ways of doing his hair as well. So I'm doing it from the sketch that Gislaine sent me on Patreon. And he's a long one coming down this side as well. Right, so then we have these sort of goggles or something in the middle, right? So they kind of like come across the middle here. I think they're those things you put across your face when you're sleeping, if I remember correctly. So curving down there, curving down there, and it kind of goes behind just his hair, disappears kind of in here, and a little spike, and then goes just up and around here. And then we have this inside broken sort of line like that, just for the rim. And then we can just see his ears kind of poking out here. Okay. And then the rest of his hair kind of sticks out from behind all of this, right? And there's real big hair spikes and stuff. So, say so like, and some goes behind his neck. We'll just do these ones first. It's different in the anime as well. So, but in general, this is what they do. This is like the biggest one. So I'll go right up to the top of my page and down there. Another one this way. All the way down. And then it goes behind his neck, right? So his neck is kind of long, elongated sort of style neck there skinny enough right, 
and then there's neck, neck muscles in here. And then a few more hair spikes just coming down here. And his trapezius that way. And it looks like his collarbone just going that way. And then his white t shirt. Out towards his shoulders, then, like male shoulders are a head width, usually, like the width of his face, not like his hair, his face. And so his shoulder would be like here somewhere. Yeah, like that, roughly. His shoulder will go down there. And that's how to draw Jin Mori. We want season two. Hopefully, Mappa do it. I know they're busy making amazing Jujutsu Kaisen and all that good stuff. Hope it's helpful, Gizlane. Thanks for the support on Patreon. See you in the next one.